Bonnie. A Milam County School is getting a lot of attention for a sign in front of its school saying its teachers are indeed armed. Thorndale ISD began the measure today when classes went back in session, but they say it happened because of the large community support for this measure. Our own Curtis Quillen is here, and Curtis, just how much support does the district say they have? Guys, okay, Superintendent Adam Ivey says more than 80% of the staff and more than 90% of parents support this measure, and their reason, they say, is simple. Really what it comes down to for Thorndale is they really love their kids. On the left, a welcome. On the right, a warning. I want someone who, who would consider harming our students to see that and say, I'm not going there. If you drive around the Thorndale ISD complex in southwest Milam County, you'll see six signs like this one reading, please be aware that the staff at Thorndale ISD are armed and may use whatever force is necessary to protect our students. As we start to see more and more of these, you know, things happening in schools and malls and churches around the country. Uh, we just decided, you know, we need to take a look at this. Superintendent Adam Ivey says with Thorndale being an isolated community in the county, they want to make sure their staff can protect the students. Before doing so, Ivey pulled the teachers, of which 82% were in support, and many volunteered. When he pulled the public, he says they got an enormous response with 94% in support. Safety for the kids and teachers and, and uh safety for all. I think it's great. Uh, to protect our students, you know, we have to do whatever it takes um, this day and age. And, um, you know, it's it's what we need to do right now at this time. Ivy also says the district can't afford to be naive and believe that what's happened across the country, including the tragedy at Santa Fe High School near Houston, can't happen in Thorndale. If something ever does happen that we can take action that will, you know, that will get us to that point where, where police arrive. Um, we know that first three to five minutes is crucial um, in, 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 a, in an action like this. And so we, we need to be able to do something until the police arrive. No, Ivy says the training will continue as long as the policy does. He adds there are many details of this policy which will remain confidential. That's to protect staff members involved and the students in Thorndale as well. Guys. All right.